come on this fly. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. I'm a new YouTuber again. My name is Bose. I'm a mother of three. What I have for you this morning is how I store my stuff after I bought them. There it is. I've cleaned the okra before I cut it off and I'm dishing it in this bag. So I can keep them in the freezer. Then when I need it, I will take one bag like this. Just blend it. And when you're blending the okra, you don't blend it too much. So I'm coming now. I'll show you how I store my stuff. Just quickly and go inside the freezer to take the frozen away do where they sell fresh away do is far to where I live. I live in Surrey in London. This is a way do in case you want a way do you want to buy a way do you couldn't see the fresh one. You can go to any Asian shop where they are selling maybe like pepper butcher store. You can see it in their freezer they call it molokia molokia chop that's uh in indian name they call it molokia that's a way do i always buy if i see it luckily maybe a lot in the store sometimes i buy three of them or five of them so this is a way i've washed my hair curl and i've cut it off and I dish them in the bag like this see so it makes life easier for us instead of buying today cutting buying cutting it's good though it's exercise but if you buy plenty of it just cut them dish them in the bag like this and put in the freezer and I know that in it immediately you buy it if you want to cook it immediately cook it immediately and dish them in the takeaway plate like this in the takeaway plate like this see that's why I always keep this Chinese bowl so that I, I can keep keep it inside when I finish cooking them then I dish it in the bag in the in the bag like this and in the plate bowl bowl like this <clears throat> and here another thing this is kills kills leaf it's very nice healthy full of nutrients and there is another one they call it green green something i can't remember the name if i go out one of these days if i see the full name i will put it i will record it with one of my I will do some other time. This is kale's leaf. 
you can cook it as you can cook it the way you cook spinach ugu bitter leaf you can cook it with egusi with anything you can eat it with rice solid food even though without cooking it's not all the time we should cook all our effort you can steam it if you like pepper like me i like pepper so i normally steam it like maybe you want to eat white rice or fried rice or jollof rice you can steam it put a little bit of crayfish or plum inside local beans just tiny bit of salt you don't need maggi maggi is not necessary in the effort all the time in the effort or spinach or kills it's not all the time you should put um maggi in your food especially in this you know, spinach or kills or green leaf any vegetable doesn't need maggi too much salt is okay a little bit of salt because there's nothing you want to eat that you won't put salt it's very nice and healthy full of nutrients and it's good for eyebrow pressure for people that have eyebrow pressure it's very good it's very important kills leaf that's k-a-l-e then leaf kills leaf it's very nice they sell it in any shop maybe morrison or Aza, Aza is Walmart, whoever that have Walmart in their area or in their country. Aza is Walmart, you can see it in there. Or Tesco, Iceland, Lidl, Audi, all these shops, they sell it in there. Kills is very good and very nice and healthy. It's good for blood, fibro pressure and another thing. Pepe, look at that. I got the sweet pepper in my fridge as well. I normally buy sometimes by luck if I go to where they sell pepper or something, maybe the high street. I buy a box of pepper sometimes, and the pepper is let me show you. like this look at this i took this out in the fridge i still have a big bag of this in the freezer and small bag as well i normally buy a lot of this keep it in the fridge and freezer to cook so that in case you want fresh sweet pepper it's not all the time you should be going to the store to be buying pepper all the time you can buy plenty like this keep it in the in the fridge keep it in here keep it in the fridge and another thing this ginger is very good it's very important in the body it does a lot of things in the body it's good for fat maybe like in the morning you can take one oh one point of um this thing lemon boil water put it in the boil water skill the lemon and when after you skill the lemon do not throw the other part away cut it in cut it into two pieces or three pieces or one or a whole like that put it inside the hot water if you have a big mug or bottle water that is big that you can put it inside and ginger just cut Cut ginger, put it inside, drink it, and in the morning you wake up. You will feel fresh, your body will be fresh in the night. You can drink it anytime. You can have a big of this. See, look at this. This is how I stuff my, store it. Can you see how strong it is? This is lemon, lemon water. I boil water and I put skills the lemon inside. After I skills the lemon inside, then I cut this this one i cut it inside and i put it in i put hot water in there good you can drink it or you go anywhere you can put it in your bottle water instead of ordinary water it's full of vitamin c but do not drink too much of it because it has a lot of acid it's very acidic 
lemon is very acidic but it's very good for body it's full of vitamin c it's nice and it's not it's not necessary for you to boil the water before you put it inside the hot water you can use normal water as well skills it inside cut the cut this part put it in there there you go you drink it that's it and another thing garlic it's very good for body when I fry egg, I put it in the egg, this two. When I cook spinach, I put it inside. I boil meat, I put it inside. I cook still, I put it inside. Anything I do, I put it inside. And if you can't eat it, it's good for high blood pressure, garlic. If you can't eat the garlic, see? I just brought one inside my fruit basket. See, look at this. What I do is I... Oops! like one of this if you can't eat two one is okay it's good for high blood pressure just take one of it chop it chop 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 when you chop it instead of before i normally eat garlic but the smell i don't like the smell but what i do is that after i remove the the cover i rinse it i chop it into pieces and i put it in my finger in my palm or in this spoon, I take water, I take it, I take it like medication. It's very nice. You can do it in that way. And this, if you can't eat it, cook it with your food. If you can't eat it raw like this, just cut a bit, eat it. You will feel that chilly bit in your throat. It's clear throat. This and um, honey. It's clear your throat. It's good for sore throat. And lemon. You can put lemon with it. It's a bit of lemon. Don't buy the... You can buy the one in the bottle. But the one in the bottle, it won't work very well like the original one. Take the original one. Buy the original one. Skills it inside the spoon. Or you can buy a lot of lemon. Skills them in the bottle. Keep it in the fridge. Then anytime you want it, you take it, garlic, lemon, and ginger, it's good. And another thing, what I always do is that one day, I will do a video of that. I do ginger, ginger, garlic, lemon, and pot. Then you put normal water, normal water from the tap. Cold water, not the hot water. Put it inside. Put on the cooker. Cut this inside. You can cut a whole of this. Or half of it. It depends. Then, four cloves of garlic. Lemon. You cut lemon as well. You cut it. You put it inside. You make sure... You can put it inside the pot. Then, put on the gas. When it's... Like, the way it's normally bubbling. Tobacco oil dada, <laughs> like bubbly tobacco oil dada. Then you put it, when you cover it in the foil, you put everything, you cook it. When you finish cooking it, when the water is boiled, yeah, boil very well. Tobacco oil dada, boil very well. Then you can take a cup, glass of cup, take it, drink it in the morning, in the afternoon. It's not necessary maybe three times a day. You can drink it any day. Cook it. When you finish cooking, you put it in the big big mug, big mug like this. Or bottle like this. Or bottle like this. You keep it inside. Then you keep it in your fridge. You can pour it in your bottle water. Take it to work. Take it to the park. Maybe you're going to gym, you're gymming, gym your body, gym, gym your body, doing this every time or jogging around. Take it with you, drink it. It's very nice. It's good. That's what I drink. I don't do exercise. Because a few couple of years ago, I booked for gym. And I never go. I thought they won't be taking money from my account. And I don't know that it's direct debit I take. I register with them, I mean, and they 
taking money from my account every time 25 pound which i don't know and that's a lot of money they took from my account and i went to the bank to the bank that they should cancel it immediately because when i went to the gym uh to the gym place they said they can't cancel it. there's nothing they can do that they can't refund my money to me and which is no good like all the work i've been doing doing night doing day doing this doing that taking my money without my concert and i don't even know that it's the little bit i did with them i just rushed to the bank to cancel it so that they won't be taking money from my account at least almost 200 pound for few months couple of months they are taking money from my account almost a year which i don't even know i just got a lot from the bank and the bank told me that oh they are taking money from my account so if we are not ready for gym all this stuff i told you is okay this or this kale sleeve rinse it cut it off with uh ginger and lemon blend it together then you drink it spinach the same thing you can drink it i should have done that i can do it but for me i feel like it make me feel sick but i will try it one day anyway maybe i will like it but it's very good very important let's look after our body i'm Place and um, place our health is more important. Health is wealth. Without good health and you have wealth, it's nothing. Health is wealth. Please, let's look after our body. Please and um, place is very important. Please. And another thing. Please. It's not when you are not feeling well. Or your children is not feeling well, or something is not like, oh, I'm having a dick, oh, I need to go to the GP because I've been having a dick for a long time, oh, this is paining you, that is pain. It's not until then you go to GP. Health is wealth. Go to GP, go for checkup at least once in two months. If you don't want to go, maybe once in a month. Once in two months is okay. You can buy the blood pressure machine as well. Keep it in your house. I have blood pressure in my house, blood pressure machine in my house, and I have blood sugar um, kit in my house as well. I check my PP sometimes once a while, my blood sugar once a while. And that's why I'm like this. I don't go to gym. Look at me. No gym. This is all what I do for myself. And I'm the kind of person I don't sit down. I sit down really, but when I start in this kitchen, I'm standing talking to you people. I don't sit down. Sometimes I will be forced to sit down. I can stand in the kitchen to cook like maybe for two hours or three hours, and I won't know that time has gone already. And I need to sit down. Please and please. Do not let us overwork ourselves. It's no good. Health is wet. Please and um, please look after your health. Look after yourself. Look after your family. Not because you you are working, you don't have time for yourself. You need to have time for yourself. Look after yourself. Health is wet. Please and um, please let's look after ourselves. Look at me. I didn't go for a gym. That's what I drink ginger with lemon and garlic and i drink water i always sleep with water i do take water with my room and please and please water is very important you just look for a small bottle maybe a bottle like this and see this is another thing i drink i drink low calorie bitter lemon that's what i drink or sweat that's what i drink Please and please, health is wet. Let's look after ourselves. Let's look at our, after our home, our family. Do not overwork yourself. If we go to work, three days is okay for you to work. Three days. Maybe you go to college. Maybe it's once a week. 
then you go to work three days is okay for you just work or look after yourself that doesn't mean that because you are working you don't have time for yourself you need to have time for yourself let's look after ourselves our health is very important play some place out is what look after yourself be happy make yourself happy if you if you feel like oh you you feel down stand up look for something go to the kitchen if you can bake go and bake if it's your bible you know how to read read your bible if it's novel read novel you will see something that can make you happy put on music go to the park you will see people there you will meet different people there that you can chat with instead of saying that on face sad or fear or just anything you can look for something to make you happy not that because we are not happy or you are sad or you are down and then you say in the day oh i'm tired i'm fed up of this life why are you fed up of this life don't be fed up of this life life goes on your life is very important our life is very important look after yourself out is what place and place our head is very important this is my video for the for today thank you very much subscribe watch share my name is Bose. i'm a mother of theory please like my video please share and watch i want to show you something over here in my store look at this cinnamon it's very good when you want to drink maybe a cup of tea just take a bit of it put it in the tea it's very good cinnamon is very good cinnamon is very good and this turmeric you can blend it with it just a bit if you buy the powder just a bit of turmeric put it in there maybe a bit of cinnamon put it in there please health is what look after yourself our life is very important our self is very important look after yourself look after your home look after your family look after yourself out is what please and please share sus share subscribe watch like thank you god bless you gracia Au revoir. Have a lovely weekend and have a lovely day. Thank you. Bye. God bless you.